Shortly after Air Force One left Washington for Argentina, President Trump canceled by airborne tweets two high-profile G20 meetings with Vladimir Putin. He did so, quote, based on the fact that the ships and sailors have not been returned to Ukraine from Russia. Russia continues to hold three Ukrainian naval vessels and more than 20 sailors it seized last weekend in the Black Sea. Russia's recent naval aggression will test how tough Mr. Trump intends to be protecting Ukraine, something he accused former President Obama of lacking. Ukraine. 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 We don't like what happened. We're not happy about it. Nobody is. And hopefully they'll be able to settle it out soon because we look forward to meeting with President Putin. But on the basis of what took place uh, with respect to the ships and the sailors, uh, that was the sole reason. Thank you very much. White House National Security Advisor John Bolton told reporters that as of Thursday, there were no plans to reschedule a meetup between the two leaders. That's because of a maritime conflict between Russia and Ukraine. It's something that uh, the president feels strongly about. Uh, I've spoken to uh, the Russians myself on the subject, and that's where we are. So I don't see circumstances uh, in the foreseeable future where such a meeting could take place uh, until the, uh, the crews and the ships are released. A lot of very positive things going to come out of the relationship. So, Vladimir, thank you very much. Thank you. 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 Thank you.